Hi everyone, how are you doing? Nice to see I've picked up a couple of uh, new subscribers. Thanks a lot for that. I'll keep you updated on uh, all the stuff I'm testing out. Stuff that I buy, I don't get given this stuff, you know. Um, I buy it and I just talk about what I buy, you know. I mean, that's the best way to be, you know. No biased um, comments or thoughts on anything. I'm quite open, you know, about everything. If you want to ask me anything, feel free to ask me. I'll be happy to help. Anyway, I've been reviewing these little smock... 22 tanks they're actually new to me I've not really um, seen them being sold by it's a bit low on juice actually that one um, I'm not bit you know there's not a lot of sellers of them so um, I don't really know whether it's a genuine smock product or someone who's decided to make them um, I'm sure the, um, you know they'll get more popular or you never know, um, but uh, I really rate them for a small tank. And this e leaf pico, I'll just show you this. This is an e leaf pico as well. Look, see that power but power adjustment on the bottom. It's got like nice little vented things there. You can pick one of these mods up for 12 quid on eBay. Uh, I've still seen them on there for that money. I've got another smock pen. Uh, sorry, I keep saying pen. But it's in the advert it says um, Smock 22 pen tank if you want to search for one. Uh, this is um they're both e leaf pickles. Look. This one's just got a skulls cover on it. It's actually silver, this one, or gunmetal. Um, single battery mod. But I found these tanks work really well on these mods. So I've actually took the Leaf Pico tanks off them because they work, but they they never really um, well. Let's just say they never really rung my bell, right? Well, I've been using this one, the black one, on coils I bought on eBay, which are three ohm, and I've been using this one on the coils that came with the kit that you get in the box, okay? Now this one I found it was a bit problematic, I don't know whether the coils um, that I bought were just not really very good and so what I did was um, I had a few packs of them so I changed from one pack, I used three coils in one pack and they just didn't seem to work very well now that's probably down to the supplier because as soon as I changed to another pack that I bought off someone else, I'm sure I bought them off someone else it seemed to work a lot better. Now I've got them both still on 40 watts. It says 30 to 50 watts. Now I'll show you the difference. Um, well I don't know if there's much of a difference. But this is the 3 ohm one. With coils I bought on eBay. Um, I couldn't find any 2.5 ohm coils. Uh, I did have a real good search. Because this is a 2.5 one. That originally comes with the smock tank. Yeah. So, um, I don't know which one to do first. I'll tell you what, if you can hear this, it always it sounds a bit, um, a bit crackly, if that's the right word. Yeah? So, just watch this, watch this go and see what you think. But check that vapour out on that little tank. Amazing. Same juice. Big clouds, little tank, big clouds. Now where's the original um, coil in, in the tank? Still quite good, lower homage. I think there's a bit of a difference there, not much. Well, still uh, on fire. Battery's about a third worn, if you can see that. Not quite full, about a third worn. This one's about the same, a little bit more strength in it. So, I've said um, before, I'd let you know what, what I thought of them. 
I think the quality bar and line aren't the best. Um, keep looking for 2.5 ohm, but I haven't found any yet. Um, but I do think these three ohm coils give a bit better cloud. You know, even though they're not, you know, I don't know whether they're smock or not. Everybody says they're smock, you know. But check the vapor out on this again. And this is the 2.5 smock coil. They're both pretty good um, for a small tank. Let me know what you think. If you bought one, let me know. Catch you later. Bye.